Um, this is a pretty good condition Super Mario Logan SML Rosalina plush I am going to unbox today. And, um, it looks like it's nice and sealed in a wrap. Um, I think, I'm pretty sure it had some dirt marks on it on the photo. So I'm not expecting it to be too clean. But yeah, oh wow, it's pretty packaged really well. Um, well I'm glad that they packaged it well. Because it actually looks like it's Amazon. It looks like it's brand new. But it's not brand new, like I said. Some fade, some wear. So maybe it like has some wear somewhere. But like... I'll clean it up after. Oh, wow. Wow. I was not expecting it to be this nice. It is actually pretty tiny. This is the thing I have been waiting for for so long. It has a long bang, another eye in the front. It almost looks like the stock image. I am so happy with this. And as you can see, it's the unlocalized one for Super Mario 3D World. And if you guys didn't know, there was an old official Rosalina, but it was made to promote the Super Mario 3D World set. And then Little Buddy decided to localize it for that set, or for the Sine Super Mario set, but Sine just went for the 3D World set, I guess. But yeah, it's 100% official. This is the one that Super Mario Logan uses. It looks so nice. I really love it so much. And uh, let's get on to the comparisons pretty soon. So here is the SML Rosalina plush. So overall, this thing is kind of worn out. Like I said, it's not like in the greatest condition, but like I cleaned her up and stuff. Like the crown's not either great really either, but like it overall, it is really, really nice. I wasn't expecting it to really be this tiny, but this is the one SML used and I'm pretty sure he got like a gajillion 3D World doll ones as well. The shoes are pretty good. The crown is pretty good also. Like the jewels kind of weird like that. Overall really good collar and I think this one is probably like one of the most accurate plushes to like Galaxy because I've compared old doll and she almost looks like it. So now let's compare her with her all-star counterpart. So here we have our all-star Ros Rosalina and um, Here's a comparison to both good dolls. These are the best Rosalina plushes I own, in my opinion. You can see, like, the color difference. And this one's actually 10 inches, and this one's only 9 inches, or 11 inches and 9 inches. So you can see the hair is pretty much the same. Mostly an upscaled version, just besides, of course, like, the hair and the bangs and like the can and all that stuff but overall it is pretty pretty nice and um yeah and uh, we we just need old peach and then we'll have like all the old plushes complete and here we have old jay-z this is an old 2013 jay-z i'm pretty sure yeah she's 2013 and um overall they both look pretty good they're both like have the same wear except like in the crown area but, like they look really really nice so all we need is old peach and then we'll have every single old and new princess and here and this actually means we completed the 3d world set well of course the medium ones are just upscaled versions, but this means we officially completed a Super Mario 3D World set because we have this Rosalina now. And we also have Cat Rosalina. You can see they pretty much look the same. It looks like this one's just in a cat suit, like old one in the cat suit and all that. This one came out in 2014, but localized by Little Buddy in 2015. So I don't know why they made this Rosalina a part of the set, but then decided to make Cat Rosalina like towards the very end of its era. But overall, this is pretty nice. Um, there is like the Sine Super Mario one, but this one's the unlocalized one. I like unlocalized plushes. I'm starting to want to get more Sine Super Mario and like unlocalized plushes. But well, overall, today marks the day of me completing my Rosalina collection because funny story. I, well, the first Rosalina I got was the derpy one right here. I was so happy with it. And then for Christmas, I managed to get baby Rosalina and then 3D World Rosalina and then all happy family. And most of you probably thought that was like the only three Rosalina that I was going to get because what other Rosalinas could you get? Well, I got this one, the Aurora run and the Ruby Red Dress Fire Rosalina. I got those two because I wanted a better looking Rosalina. But these ones were okay, so I decided to customize these two. I got another one, it was okay. I got another one, it was alright. But then the one, I'm trying to get it on the camera. Now this one is the Golden Rosalina over here, you can see. Very, very beautiful and everything. So that means I wrapped up collecting Rosalinas for good. And then I got Super Mario Logan one on the exact same ordered the Super Mario Logan one on the exact same day, and then this one ended up being really good, so. 
Yep, that's my collection of Rosalina plushes. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching this unboxing. If you liked it, make sure to check out more unboxings in the future. So yeah, that pretty much wraps up this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing of the SML Rosalina plush the Super Mario Logan. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye!